हेलो फ्रेंड्स वेलकम टू माय चैनल दिस इज एलोवेरा प्लांट आई एम गेटिंग सो मेनी मैसेज फ्रॉम माय फ्रेंड हु आर सेइंग देयर एलोवेरा प्लांट्स आर डाइंग सो आई थॉट टू मेक अ वीडियो हाउ टू टेक केयर एलोवेरा Aloevera is most popular house plant. It is a succulent plant that means it store water inside its body. It has thick leaf. Leaves contain jelly inside its body. The jelly of aloe vera has medicated value. The plant is stemless and very short. and evergreen plant excess water can damage aloe vera plant because aloe vera plant store water inside their body so so water your plant through capillary action take a bowl and fill the bowl with water 2 inches water level is enough Now place your plant inside the water. Let it be inside the water at least 30 minutes. A upper surface of the soil will get water through capillary action. Through this process the root will get sufficient water. and the water will not hamper the leaves if the plant gets more water then the plant will start rotting and if the plant gets less water then the leaves of the plant will bend like this way without water it cannot produce jelly that's why the leaves bend pot is another important part of aloe vera for aloe vera always choose clay pot or terracotta pot terracotta pot allows the soil to take breath air goes in air goes out prepare a light soil mix with 40% soil 40% sand and 20% compost the plant like well drained soil mix make sure water is not stand between the soil mix if water stand then that will damage your plant root of the aloe vera is small compared to its body so within a small pot it can grow easily aloe vera is air purifying plant as we know in the day time plants take carbon dioxide and produce oxygen in a night time plant absorb oxygen and produce carbon dioxide aloe vera plant is succulent plant at the presence of the sunlight the few tissue of aloe vera plant remain close to store water inside their body at the night time they open that tissue to absorb carbon dioxide and they preserve the carbon dioxide inside their body at the morning time and the present of the sunlight they use the preserve carbon dioxide to do photosynthesis photosynthesis process and produce oxygen so friends aloe vera plant absorb carbon dioxide at night time if you keep aloe vera in your bedroom then at the night time the bedroom will be fresh keep your plant under indirect sunlight direct sunlight will burn your plant 
12 degrees Celsius temperature to 27 degrees Celsius temperature is good for aloe vera. Feed your plant monthly once. Banana peel tea is based fertilizer for aloe vera plant. Banana peel tea, tea is sweet in taste, so it attracts more ants and insect and bacteria. So give your plant neem oil. If possible, then spray neem oil uh, monthly twice. If possible, then give your plant monthly once organic liquid fertilizer. Aloe vera is very easy to grow and hardy plant. Without any care, it can survive. Too much water and too much direct sunlight can damage the plant. Mature aloe vera plant can produce flower. Flower blooms on a long string. Propagation of aloe vera is very easy. Baby aloe vera plant sprout roots from its mother plant roots. If you want a new plant, then split the baby plant from its mother plant and place the baby plant in another potting soil mix. After repotting the baby plant, keep the plant under indirect sunlight and don't give water the new plant at least 3 weeks. Aloe vera is hardy plant. It can survive in low light condition. It can be used as a room decoration purpose. You can place them on the top of the refrigerator and corner table on study table, dining table or center table or beside of the stair. It will give you a pleasant look. So, so friends, must keep at least one aloe vera plant at your home. Thank you for watching my video. Let me know about your aloe vera plant. For the time being, goodbye. See you soon.